Hey guys, it's Mr. Phil Video from Funny Pond Show. Um, this is a four digit button lock combo tutorial. I did this already, I already recorded it, but the audio was messed up, so I had to abandon it, and I'm really sad about that because the tutorial took me a little bit of time to make, but I'll do it again. So, this is the wall, and you have four buttons, you press one, two, three, four, door opens, that is my password for the door, you can change it in the tutorial, and reset switch to close it. So, this was the one that I was building for the tutorial, it sadly did not end well. So we're gonna go right here, and I'm just gonna destroy some of these little redstone things that don't matter. So first thing you're gonna want to do, let me get my red wool back, um, actually I can get rid of dispensers because I want to have some light, whoops, not a door, okay, so, you're gonna first make your module, which is your four buttons on the stand, and of course have your four redstone torches hitting the back, and you're gonna extend out three, extend out Actually, no, you're gonna go like this and like that. Mm, like that. Okay. Now, this side is actually gonna be. Okay, wait. Sorry. Yes, you do build like this. Uh, this side is gonna be repeater, repeater, uh, redstone, redstone. This side is gonna be redstone, redstone, redstone. Um, for your top, you're gonna make it extend three. Redstone, 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 redstone. For this one, you're gonna put it to the side. And put a block. And redstone, redstone. Extend it up. Redstone. Get out of here, cow. Um, and then redstone on top of that. So now you have your module. And now what you're gonna do is go one. Two, three, four, five, and then go back eight. One, two, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then you're gonna go down. You're gonna get rid of this. So now you're gonna build your RS Nor latch, or RS Nor latches, and of course you build these like this. torches on like that and on this side as well and when you're placing down your repeaters make sure to put them down facing this way or make sure to place this one first instead of this one first because that'll just mess up your whole design okay now what you're gonna do put a block a redstone torch Block, block, redstone, uh, torch, block here, block here, block here, uh, redstone, 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 and redstone. Uh, on this one, you're gonna do the same thing, only extend it a tiny bit. So it's like this uh, redstone, 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 redstone. I extend it one more out. Do the same thing, and we can actually get rid of these blocks. Like that. And third one, we're gonna do the same thing. Like so. And for this one, of course, you extend out four so that you don't get any cross stock. So like that, and now all you gotta do is hook these up. First thing you're gonna wanna do is hook them to inverters, and just do it like this, exactly how I'm doing it. Um, my combination calls for actually 
having it exactly like this, where I have um, my, I'll show you in a second. I'll tell you about it in just a second. So, for you can build it like this, but what what happens is my combination is the bottom one, top one, top one, bottom one. So, I connect them like that. The top the top one or the bottom one right here goes into the first arsenal latch. Top one right here goes into the second arsenal latch. Uh, this bottom one, which would be the this one right or the top one, which would be this one right here, goes down to that arsenal latch, and this one goes to this or arsenal latch. So basically, you can have them in any combination. So if you want it differently, say you want this button first, then you connect the this button to the first iris and latch but for the sake of it I just went like this because it was the easiest you can build it like this it doesn't really matter how you build it just that it works I guess so we'll just put that under I don't want to put that down down and down so now that oh, whoops I meant to put it down to or out to like that and then like that like that and like so and it should be done so let's just test it out bottom one top one top one bottom one and if you see that, then your output right here should be uh, open like so. So it should should be the output should be correct. And I'll show you how I built the door connecting to it. Um, we're just gonna build a small little template to explain I guess uh, you're gonna put your door wherever you want just as long as it's not touching that or close to that and you're gonna build a little square under your door like that put a block with a torch and go back three whoops go back three this that there this this um, remember where your block is. You can go back here, and then this is. Remember, this is your output right here. We're gonna extend that into the door. So now that the now your door should be open if you get it right. Um, so that's how you make the combo lock. I'm gonna actually quickly show you a reset button. So to build your reset button, you go in the back, place it to two repeaters, connect them, and extend it to w really wherever you want. It doesn't matter where your reset button goes. Just um, I'm just gonna put it in the wall because it's easiest for me. But anyway, that is how you build a. Combo lock, uh, you should actually test out your reset. Uh, so it hasn't worked, so... Let's see what's going on. Oh. Check that your reset works, like that. Should close the door, and if it worked properly, all four of these torches should be lit. And also, if you do the wrong combo of course it's just gonna reset every time but keep in mind also if you do the wrong combo so say that you have the combination that I have down up down da or up down then make sure that when you're if you accidentally press the wrong combo see how I hit this button right here 
then it's already started the combination so if uh you can hit it again but it really won't do anything you can just keep in mind that you can just go uh hit these three after you've hit that one but yeah this is how you can uh, make a four digit combination lock in minecraft um you can tidy it up a bit do whatever you like to it but uh if you like this video please rate comment subscribe for more redstone tutorials, and uh, this has been Mr. Phil Videos from the Funny Poncho. See you later.